Hello everybody, welcome back to the Angry Badger channel. I'm your host, Angry Badger Girl. And today we're doing another episode, episode 2 of Batman the Telltale series, season 1. Um, so now we gotta get into uh, the children of Arkham. So this is where it starts explaining um, who the main antagonist of this story is. So it says here, children of Arkham. An old friend becomes a new adversary as Bruce learns more about the Wayne family legacy, and Batman escalates the fight against crime and corruption throughout Gotham. Okay, let's get into the game, huh? Well, I did change my mice around, so hopefully that won't be such an issue this time. But, uh, I guess we'll find out, huh? I gotta get my fuel too, you know? Shut up, Harvey. Little bag. Also, if you didn't notice, I uh, changed my setup a little bit, so hopefully you can see my see me a little bit better and uh see my camera a little bit better so Ooh, looks like i'm lagging a little bit that's not good Alright, so this is pretty much a, um, a whole, uh, what do you call it, backstory from the first episode. This is all the choices I made throughout the first episode. Alright, and we just finished the first episode with, uh, with Bruce finding out that his parents were part of the gangster, screw, uh, gangster crew in, uh, Gotham. Biggest gangsters in God. And then he's got it. He found out even Alfred kept that from him for like 20 something years. Oh, yeah, he wasn't too thrilled, was he? Story series adapts to the choices you make. Wayne Memorial Auditorium. So that auditorium is uh, was renamed from the theater that right out, yeah right outside where his parents were killed. So that's where he's visiting now. Is that alley? That's a tough thing. Man. <clears throat> Oh no, Alfred, you got a lot of explaining to do, buddy. A lot of money behind Wayne's Pitch. Just 
to be fair, Bruce has every right to be pissed, to, to be pissed off. To be fair, that's that's pretty true. I noticed this like in the preview. Bruce's eyes look really like glassed over. Like he's in like some serious shock or something. Or he decided to get to get stoned before any of that. I don't know. But he his eyes are like seriously glassy from the rest of this. Yeah, but to be fair, he was a kid in shock. Yeah, you may recall every moment, but but that doesn't mean you didn't, or that doesn't mean you didn't think of something then that that you didn't understand then and probably understood now. I've done that. Well, I thought it was one thing before, and then I realized it wasn't. It was com something completely different. Excuse me. I'm always ready for a nap, aren't I? <laughs> I should be called Sleepy Badger instead of Angry Badger, huh? I do like how they had uh, the plot twist where like his his parents were the mobsters rather than like the the greatest people in the city. It's I, I like how they they changed the hell of a twist in both season one and season two. I I like the plot twist that they like doing with this.
not Bruce, do you? Jesus. Hers was in the friggin' heart, but his was in the goddamn eye. Holy fuck. Of course, he took the stuff to make it look like a robbery. That's just dumb. Waste half the fucking necklace. I, I, I know people who make, I know someone who makes, like, pearl jewelry, and pearls can be really worth something. The fact that he just snatched that and only got like a handful compared to all of that necklace. That whole necklace was a good couple hundred dollars, I guarantee you. And he just like wasted half of it. But, point is, in that, what he just revealed is that Joe Chill was hired to kill his parents. Alright, GCPD, 8.56 a.m. Really need to see my phone like this? Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, look, it's that asshole. So he's trying to sneak in the Falcone of asking what the hell was going on about his dad or about his parents. Oh yeah, screw you and your debate, Harvey. Come on. If you're supposed to be my buddy, you should be understanding. I do like her as a character too. Like, granted, she's not a fan of Batman's per se, but at the same time, she was just doing her job. But you know, she's she's like one of the good ones. Trying. Yeah, he's lucky I didn't beat the shit out of him. 
Children of Arkham. Yeah, I had the choice to actually, like, impale him with the friggin' metal rod coming out of his abdomen, but I was like, nah, I'll be nice. I'm sure he's been married. So you had him killed, you dick. as I hate Falcon. Do I want to give him the morphine? I need them to talk, so I need to be a little bit nice. Batman's not a complete asshole. Because he said hurt him or give or. It's tempting that Batman don't kill. Fuck Montoya. Oh shit. Um sh uh. Fuck. Like I didn't do nothing, bro. Shit, show mo so much for my information. So much for a case. That's not fucking good. Damn! My toy all kinds of sacked out. Of course, I wasn't supposed to be in there. Or Bruce, I should say, Bruce wasn't supposed to be in there in the first place. That Falcone got killed in his fucking bed? Thank you. 
Perfect timing. That's where the greatest detective comes in. I wish my smartphone acts as a friggin' highly intelligent computer. Oh shit. Here we go again. Like he's always gotta be around in the wrong spot.
Sorry. Sorry, I like Montoya a little bit more than you, Becky. Long game, gotta do some stretches, right? Throwing it up on the monitor. Not much. Sorry, Alfred. Really didn't learn much. Will we boost it up? Mm -hmm. 
4.57 p.m. in the sky. What's up with Mr. Big and Creepy over here? He's like a friggin' rock troll or something. And yoink! Out you go! Go eat a bat. Oh, wait. <laughs> I think. Okay, that was good. Rolling? I think I know that voice. Like Damn right. He's got a point with that. I don't care about this. That's probably why you stopped so much. Bye. Oh. Apparently I have an issue with the E button. Good lord. Apparently I still have an issue with the E button. Oh, oh. Good lord. Okay, um. E. E. Q. Still have an issue with the Q button. Come on, you're gonna give me this shit with the Q and the E buttons. Why don't you just make this easier for me, guys? I don't- I have a small hand as it is, and I'm not very quick with my left hand, because I'm not left-handed. Uh, okay. Gonna make me go against Big Billy here. Jesus. Ah, blow me. Um... E? Oh, come on, I hit E. You guys are jerk offs. Hit E. Spam E. Spam E. Good lord. Sometimes man, just shift E is a pain in the ass, too. Like, come on. This is so much easier on a controller. Because I played this originally on a PS4 system. And instead. I'm trying to do this on a keyboard, 
and I'd rather do this on my controller. Oh, I need to talk to you urgently. Oh, I do like this part though. Stacked deck. No capes. Of course, he was going to find a way to get her phone number. got a point. Is that first ring? Could be worse. Must be a pretty damn big pond. she can. Yeah, really. And here we go.
Really though? Gotta be like the whole beating ass on the jukebox thing, huh? No, not really. Bye. She's like, <laughs> excuse you. Thank you. E. That time I I missed E. Oh. In your face. Uh. Ah, I'm starting to get used to this now, jerk faces. Itching at the wrong time. Yeah, you want to get your ass beat. You know when they make me do the mouse all of a sudden. These guys don't have a damn clue who they messed with. Well, let's I'm sure that lady that owns the bar is probably going to be pissed. predominantly like at least they, they selected mainly Q for this so I'm not switching back and forth there we go boom I think it's time to go now Come on, you already knew this was gonna happen. It always happens. Yeah, buddy. Uh, but to be fair, I believe in the comics, in like the most recent comics or something, they revealed that they're actually engaged now. So. Fair enough. Pretty good reason to run, too, homie. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. You keep shaking all them curves at him, of course he's gonna say yes. That's pretty neat. I wouldn't be standing there in the alleyway, though.
I guess we're going to have Yep, it's time to have a chat. See, it's tough because, I mean, yeah, Batman right now is in a good light, but he also doesn't, he's not also supposed to be the kind of person that, um, sticks to one side. Like, if anybody's a bad guy, he's going to get an answer regardless if he's in a good light or a bad light. He's going to get his answer no matter what. Whereas Bruce right now, which would suck because Batman's in a, in a good limelight, you know, he has the people behind him. Whereas, with with Bruce right now, where he's already being looked at as as a possible crime boss from his family, and, you know they already everybody already knows that Falcone was was um, was corrupted, and then they thought, oh well, I guess he's working for Falcone, and then Falcone gets killed, and now you know everybody already knew that Mayor Hill was corrupted prior. I don't know if anybody put two and two together, but if he goes to visit Falcone, he ends up dying, and then now he visits Mayor Hill, what's gonna happen to Mayor Hill, what's gonna happen to his image. So as much as I think it'd be okay to go visit as Bruce, I think we're gonna go visit as Batman. Because Batman don't give no shits. <laughs> He's got to get his answer, regardless of if he's in a good light or not. City Hall, 7-11 p.m. Yeah, but everybody knows how he's corrupted anyway, Alfred. <laughs> I'm a light touch. Ooh, okay. Yep. Yeah, the city will thank him if they get rid of a corrupted ass mayor. Which is B. Oh, he's threatening to cut his secretary's pay just because he's, like, down in holes. Hehe. <laughs> Poof. <laughs> Deborah's not here right now. Please leave a message after the beep. <laughs> oh, shit. Dun -dun. What's up, brother? Yeah, okay, because your pudgy little self is going to be a run, Batman. <laughs> Spartan kick.
He just has a habit of ripping that damn thing off, man. from the security cameras at the auditorium. Watch your back, Tom. It has to be safe. Security loop. One more than may have been absent. I have to get down there. Now. I mean, that's the smartest thing. If you want to confuse someone with cameras. God damn it, Harvey. It's like, we can't be friends right now. God damn it. Thank you. 
I should have just dipped him over and just be like, okay, by the way, I'm taking your girlfriend too, you bitch. I like how they keep making face jokes with Harvey. It's kind of messed up. God damn it, Harvey. Wayne Memorial Auditorium. 8.27 p.m. Sorry, brother. I didn't mean to make it sound like that. I didn't realize he was gonna sound like that much of an asshole. The security has been compromised. I got patrols on every door. You better check on them. I'll keep you posted if I need you. What's he doing? He was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Dude, you're gonna blab out that kind of noise. We're all on the same side. <laughs> Seriously, what it reminded me for like that split second. What's up, brother? Made you look smash. Had to get a little old bat drone in here. Oh, that's no good. Great, big and grumpy's over here.
here we go. Just missed that. Ding! Oh, that ding sound like a friggin' frying pan. Doink! Boop your head! Hey, you say go! <laughs> they ain't gonna question that. And mind you, that's the same stuff that they hit Montoya with to make them, uh, make their moral inhibitions completely out the window. So they, they wanted to show how asinine and how, how much of an asshole both these people really are. Oh, Daddy Dearest. made her like seriously insane. Jesus, here we go again with Big Bubba. Or what's his name, Ro Roland or some shit like that? I don't care. It's gonna be Roly Poly Oly in a minute. I'm gonna kick his ass into the dust. Oh, not my little drone. 
Coming back now. I know how to use these buttons now, bro. That was Mayor Asshole, huh? That's right, he's still underneath the drug thing. And then I do deserve it. There goes Hill. Eat that, homie. Oh, yeah, that's right. This is some messed up stuff. Now, do I save them or do I save Selene? Extra rice crispy. Ditch the helmet too, huh? Either, either way, the reason why I saved Selene is because I already knew either way he'd become Two Face. Uh -huh. either, either way, the reason why I saved Selene is because I already knew either way he'd become Two Face. It, Harvey's gonna be more pissed off. Either way, he still becomes Two Face. Yeah, I'm recording. He picked up that vial, what they inject him with. Try and get more analysis of what uh what they use. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continues to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. Yeah, seriously, I mean... Wow! Alright, that's it. Episode 2, Children of Arkham. Alright, ladies and gentlemen.
that's the end of episode two of season one of Batman and Telltale series. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you again next time. I'm Angry Badger Girl.